up everybody Waldo from Polyfiber um, we're gonna watch this video on covering an Aranka sedan uh, we're gonna go through some of the details this is actually video number two uh, in the first video uh, you can see uh, the belly being covered and also the initial placement on the fabric for the right side of the fuselage uh, we'll go ahead and watch the video and then I kind of talk you through uh, some of the details and the you know things that are going on during the video so let me hit play here okay here on the first part you can see that basically half of the fuselage is being covered uh, to begin with the belly's already done um, you know the fabric is only so wide so you have to do one half at a time now I'm gonna pause the video here uh, I want you to notice on the top of the spine and basically the uh, the roof area if you think about it that way uh, from the cockpit the very top of it um, once again the fabric is only so wide so I couldn't completely cover the uh, the top of the fuselage so I have to do that section with a separate piece of fabric and there you can see a, a good picture of um, how I glued the fabric into those formers um, and left that skylight or top of the spine completely open uh, and then on another video we'll show how, how I covered that section okay but for this video um, just if you question why that's open uh, then now you know that the fabric wasn't wide enough to cover that area so I had to terminate it there and cover that area with an individual piece of fabric. First, uh, you'll see that I I have the fuselage on a rotisserie, so I roll it over on its side. And you want to wrap the side of the fabric around the bottom laundron and get your overlap from fabric to fabric on the belly of the fuselage. It does two things, okay? Remember, we're gonna need a one inch overlap of fabric to fabric. And you can see here where I am drawing the line. That's going to be my trim cut. And it gives me a one inch overlap of fabric to fabric. Another thing, <clears throat> I put the overlap on the bottom of the belly because that seam you'll see forever. But if it's on the bottom of the airplane, <clears throat> nobody's ever really going to see it. Okay, so um, you draw your line. You put a little bit of polytech on the line. You let that completely dry. And then you could get a nice trim cut with uh, without the fabric fraying because that polytech glues the fibers together. Okay. Uh, if you have to cut around any tabs, you do um, if possible. And you can wrap the fabric around a tube then you go ahead and take the time to do that. And you can see that here in this uh, this section of the video. So the fabric was already laid on there, uh, mostly glued down. And now we're just doing the final trim cuts and gluing before we could actually do the other side of the fuselage. forward here we're basically uh, done here with the belly 
then we'll come around the fuselage and what we'll do next is do the final trim and gluing of the spine area there and all the way up the vertical fin and around the vertical fin to the back end and right here you can see some of the details of how I glued it in to the spine piece and then the video gets into doing the vertical fin and so on So guys, if you like this video, subscribe. We're going to keep on posting more videos on covering the Aronka sedan. And uh, if you have any questions, just you know, shoot us a comment and uh, we'll try our best to answer your questions. Thanks for watching.